Hello, people! My name is Rage, and welcome one and all to Rebirth. Sometimes, I feel like the world would be a better place if we had talk different days. I, I don't mean this is how I would talk on my different days, but could we please talk about the fact that I have just started with the head of a god? I have just started with the Eye Eternal. Blessed be his name, his Eden hair flopped to the right. Let sexy be done. I'm a little bit excited. Very xylophones free, xylophones. Wait, one of those was not correct. Highly yoked lemming king. So he's a king of le lemmings, but he is highly covered in yoke. Which is kind of disgusting. But as I was saying, I feel like we all need a talk differently day and i don't mean differently like you suddenly go really weird i, I don't mean that kind of crap let's not be mental here i mean just just raise or lower the pitch of your voice slightly for a day so if i'm talking normally like this i guess i would switch to talking normally like this so you know it's still my normal talking patterns but you know just for a little bit i'm, I'm slightly I'm, I'm, I'm slightly sort of a little bit higher pitch you know and i think that kind of makes sense and i freaking super meat fan and you also could go a little bit lower than a freaking super me it's actually okay all right i'm gonna lay it down as a challenge now all of y'all watching this you isaacinians of glory you it's actually kind of a challenge to talk at a different pitch, but still use the same inflection and talking style that you normally use. So say I was like, absolutely flawless, absolutely flawless. It's not quite the same, and nor is absolutely flawless. I mean, that's a little bit similar because it's easy to do with rhythm, I guess. But when you're talking normally, but when you're talking normally, it's <laughs> it just sound absolutely stupid. I feel like I should never have brought this up as a potential discussion topic. I feel like I've just really wasted everybody's time. <laughs> oh, oh my god. What is this run? What is this run? Do I even care about the rest of the floor? I guess I do a little bit, because I might as well. I also should use that and get explosive diarrhea, which actually would have been very useful in here. But I shall shed a tear because I was wasting it. Mamma mia. That's my disgrace song. It's a good disgrace song. All right, so a distinct lack of bombs, which is... Oh! Okay, distinct lack of bombs, which is a problem. We at least get an extra money from that explosive diarrhea. So it wasn't wasn't a completely wasted explosive diarrhea. Still not a good sentence to say at any point. But at the same time, I don't think we have any right to complain how this run has been going so far. I think that is definitely a true statement we, we can make there. Because... Even Envy is falling to the might of the starting floor godhead here. He really is. And we get infinite keys to then immediately access this entire floor, thereby saving all of our keys, and then earn extra keys. There is just a distinct, a distinct part of me that, you know what, I'm gonna call it right now, and this may be shocking, but I'm gonna call it, I think I'll complete this run. And you know what, we haven't been to the lamb in ages, and I think as we're already this powerful, hey, Mongo baby, good to see you, I think as we're already this powerful, I think we can confidently kill the lamb, have some nice roast lamb, I actually really hate lamb. Like, as a food. I'm, I'm just not a fan of lambs. I'm really, really not. They just, they just don't do much for me. I just never been, I've never liked the, the texture of the meat, the taste. It's just, it's not my favourite animal to consume, you know? I think overall I would give that honour to the pig. I think, I think the pig is the best general purpose meat based animal for general consumption. You know, a lot of you might think the cow, but, but I, alright, alright, let me, let me lay it down. If you could only eat one animal for the rest of your life, all right, what would it be? I think pig would by, be far and away the most popular choice across most of the world. 
Honestly, for the most part, at least most of the world that you guys would be a part of, I guess that makes more sense. I think it would be, but you know, let me know. I, I mean, it would be a shame because then I'd miss out on duck. I think duck is uh, arguably my joint favorite meat, but you can only really have duck in so many ways, namely as Thai or Chinese food orientated. You don't just go to the shop, pick up a duck and, and bung it in the oven, you know, not like you could with some roast pork, for example. But maybe this entire you know, musing that I'm doing here is completely pointless in every way, so who knows? Though I guess actually that's probably just my videos, isn't it? Most of the things he talks about are completely pointless in every way, however, I find myself enjoying them, so I guess I can't really complain, and it was bound to happen with this many tinted rocks around the place, so we have uh, getting even more damage on our glorious path of destruction. Hey, monstro, uh, how do you do today? You're so dead, just so dead. Oh my word! Bum 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 bum. Look at that now, already. Oh my god! It's just, it's something, isn't it? It is something. I guess we'll go the Devil Deal route. We already have the Godhead, so there's no real reason not to. I'm just tempted to get the nail over the prayer card, but we're gonna get a lot of Devil Deals, I would assume. So I'm thinking maybe it's more sensible not to. Potentially. I'm not entirely sure either way. Alright, other catacombs then. Not really worth it. Despite our low consumables, it's still not really worth it. That was an unfortunate damage to take there. I kind of got a little bit sloppy, thought I could kill them all before they fired, and I guess that's the main mistake. You know when you get confident that you can kill them all, and, and then you just don't? Yeah, it's, it's one of those one of those shameful times, I think. Lost a little bit of money on the greeds. How dare they! I think one of the worst things about the Curse of Amnesia is I always just play with assuming that I have it on after I've had a flaw with it on because it just, I don't know, it just sinks in. I guess I forget that it's only for one flaw. Because <laughs> Amnesia. God, nobody has ever made Amnesia. Oh my word! Are you serious? That is actually double freaking attraction. What is this? What is this? Does it stack or is it the same level of uh, homing? I don't actually know with these things. Alright, what we got in here? Mum's key's pretty good, but unfortunately nothing else is uh, really doing there. So we kind of just got to walk on by, walk on by, and accept that that's the way to go. It's just, it's just ridiculous. Hey, Gertie Jr., how are you doing? Pretty good? Well, you're dead now, so... Doesn't really matter anymore, does it? And we do get ourselves an extra devil deal containing... Abaddon! <sighs> containing... Abaddon. We are a godhead-wielding Abaddon. How often can you actually say that this occurs? Because I'm thinking not very often. I feel like this is a one in a thousand at least run. And that's kind of nice. Oh, Curse of the Lost again. Free Bob's Brain! Don't mind if I do. You are worth any amount of keys to me, Bob's Brain. Yes, you are. Ooh, Goat Head is lovely, because that means we're definitely not going to miss any of our Devil Deals going on here. Although I do want to wait until I have an extra key before I open that chest, just in case of the item room having to be skipped. I'd hate for that to be. But then there's also a part of me that's like, ah, just go for it. And I think, you know, immediately, I have been rewarded for just going for it. I was going to walk away from fate. And I guess that is really true what they say. You can't walk away from your fate. Because, <laughs> oh, come on, that was pretty good. I mean, I'm assuming you're all just sat there like, really, really, man, really. And, you know, I don't think, I don't, I think that's fair enough. I think that's fair enough. If we get magic mushroom, imagine that. Boom, what are you? Tears down. Doesn't really matter in any way, shape, or form. Now, does it? It's, th there's not much we could, oh, oh, is that not just lovely? We'll, of course, get some more red hearts for some devil dealage. Let's grab this one to reveal Tammy's freaking head. And suddenly, I think we have something a lot more fun than the prayer card. Well, I would argue that the prayer card is more useful to us at this time, I think you can't really beat a good bit of Tammy's head. That really could be taken out of context quite severely. 
but we also don't need to worry about that. Up we go. Hey guys. Oh, they didn't immediately try and kill me. I hate it when people don't immediately try and kill me. It's just it's very sad. It's very, very sad. Whom? Oh, that is so, so powerful. If we got piercing shots from somewhere, crack the sky can go crack off. Really, really can. It's just... Look at it. It's just pathetic. It's four beams. I know it does more when there's enemies, but it's just... It's just not what you want, really. This is almost the level of having Brimstone in Tammy's head. It's it's the holy equivalent of it. And that's kind of cool. It really is. Ah, oh, poor I, I don't know why I'm saying poor Eden, actually. He's just having the time of his life here, so... You know, go Eden. I'm kind of jealous of you. I wish I had these kind of powers on tap. And... Oh, secrets map and a spirit heart. We'll get the spirit heart at least, and then da -da -da dodge, and then all of them die horribly. Maybe I should have waited for that to happen before acquiring the spirit heart. That I will accept, but I was eager. I was eager as the proverbial beaver for it to occur. Oh, why do they get smushed from tears? I really thought it was only explosives that do that, but I guess I was wrong. And boom, what are you? Pheromones? Ah, it's okay. Alright, Fallen. Yeah. Yeah. Let's grab a free sacrificial dagger. Not bad. And then, of course, we were going to have to face Krampus at one point, so this is no surprise. And unfortunately, we get Head of Krampus. Uh, which, while also fantastic, isn't quite as fantastic as uh, having Tammy's head in this situation. So let's boogie on down to the depths. Uh, oh, the depths because of the unknown. One, two, three. Nothing really going on there. It's kind of lame. And uh, that should do with all that. What are you? You were an I can see forever. Really, really useful. I, I just feel like back to back, non stop, everything that can go right in this run is like genuinely going really right in this run. So it does scare me that I feel like something just terrible is going to happen soon because how could it not? It's just, I, I've, I've used up too much good karma on these runs. I, I mean, it just, it's just absurd. Oh, hello, you two. Oh, you're dead. I, I guess you tried. I, I guess you did try. Kind of want to go for, for Guppy. Just because I don't really need anything from Golden Chest. So, I'm just sort of going to make this occur. That's kind of nice. What do you have for me? Just some flies. Kind of lame. And... Oh! God, it's so strong. It is so... So strong. I don't actually need to do that because I don't need any extra health. And this being depths one, I can just do the boss now. We'll just blow you up a little bit because I can't resist. Hey, an extra key is actually a nice little return there. I trade bombs for keys all day, every day. God, it's just... It's just... It's, it's, it's just... Yeah. Oh my god! I was like, we'll go for Guppy. And then I immediately get the best starting Guppy item for going to Guppy. I mean, I would love to get the ceremonial robes. I really, really would, but I don't really have a way of uh, doing that at the moment. Four Tatar energy. Good God. kind of still wish I had the prayer card at this point. Do I even have a way of uh, acquiring? That was, that was really bad on the bomb tap there, I'll admit. But, you know, it's fine. Do I even have a way of... Uh, Gaining an extra heart so I can take ceremonial robes. I don't think I chose the correct thing there because now that we've got Guppy We're gonna get more red chest thanks to the combination with the trinket, which is Hopefully going to result in some Definite Guppy ejection, but I'm just kind of vainly going around the rooms on the odd chance something gets me an extra Red heart to play with. I mean, I don't think it's gonna happen, but you never know and I guess actually the godhead having homing makes this Tammy's head combination a lot lot better. Oh god the the item room Oh ho, ho, It actually freaking happened. We don't have to give up on freaking ceremonial robes <laughs> Oh this run all right full visible map I will take because that's just very useful and we get the perfect amount of money for it So all in all very very good there 
Oh, I am just so... I, I just It's one of those runs where you just want to look and just be smug at everyone who knows about Isaac. It, it really is. I mean, the fact that we get to add ceremonial robes as damage on top of all of this is just... Is just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And because, of course, we found the... Uh, oh, we look so much cooler now as well. And because we found the goat head, we can do stuff like this. So, uh, really, everything in this run has come together to just be fantabulous. Absolutely fantabulous. And then we go to the Devil Deal, and yeah, I'll grab a free Heart Rotten Baby, why not? Some extra flies uh, are very, very useful. And then what do you have? Just a pill with some pheromone action. I mean, I could pheromone you, but it would kind of be very pointless, I feel. I mean, we'll make him love us because, you know, he's Monstro too, and he, he, he you know, he, he, likes to, he likes to help out. He does. He likes to, likes to help out around the place, and I can't really blame him for that. I can't. Now release me! gonna be a drop isn't there there's not a drop the one time i'm there prepared for the drop there's not a drop from that very nearly worked i keep forgetting i kind of have tammy's head because it's just ridiculous distinct lack of guppy items considering the volume of chests we are getting still nothing in that one i will acquire you guppy I will acquire you. Mark my words. There we go once more. That is two of three. Ah, I mean, we don't need Guppy. It's just Guppy on top of this is going to be the best thing in the world. What do you have? <gasps> yes, please. We are doing a storm of holiness. That is a lot of fun. Monstro's Lung Godhead. What more could you ask for? I guess various buffs to my range now. Some mum items would actually be pretty nifty here, but it's just not a big deal. It is just not a big deal. Actually makes it harder to just clear a room simply because uh, we can't hit everything at once anymore. But I don't think that's the biggest issue going. Anything in here? Nothing crazy worth it, which means we are definitely going to be in time for our boss rush. But then again, I don't think we really ever considered that the alternative might happen. Yeah, I kind of didn't want that to blow up in my face, but also doesn't really matter. Hello, mother. Wow. Wow. And then we get that there. Boom, but a boom. All right, let's grab ourselves the negative. Go in here. Oh, yeah, that was one we got teleported to. That's fine. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Ho, 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 ho. Could get Gerald. I do like Gerald. I'm a fan of Gerald. You know what, guys? I'm gonna fight for Gerald. I'm gonna fight for our, our rights to be together once more. Yes, I am. I'm gonna fight for Gerald. And it's going to be glorious. He's going to love me. Gerald is going to love me. Ooh. He's actually tanking these shots really too effectively. It's kind of upsetting me. Oh, yeah, I just realized Mongo Baby is an extra fly producer because he's copying my only familiar. That makes him so much stronger. Mongo with Rotten is one of the best combinations in the game that isn't absurd, but is just very, very good and strong. So that's really nice to have here. That should explode most of them pretty quickly. Come on, can they do their homing when they're being Monstro's Lunged? I guess they still can, they just don't have as much of a range at which to do it because they're kind of being flung in a clump. Maybe it was actually a downgrade to get Monstro's Lung, but I mean, when you're already rocking the Godhead, can you really reasonably say no to Monstro's Lung? Because I feel like that's just an offense or something. I really, really do. And laser. Oh, not a laser. You're not just immediately going for it. That surprises me. That really, really surprises me. Though, what doesn't surprise me is how dead you are. I love being able to do the boss rush. It's just such a rush. Ha ha ha. Oh, I'm just so funny. You know, just really, really funny. Bad at timing, it would seem, but really, really funny. And voila. Ooh, Mr. Bloat is next, but he should be 
absolutely fine. Ah, stupid radioactive poop. Don't you just hate it when radioactive poop gets in your way? It's just the worst. It is just the worst. And we are nearly at the final leg of our journey. And... Oh, no, one more. One more. For, in fact, no, I'm gonna I'm gonna use this on them. Just oh wow, I really thought that would clear a wave at least, but no, it just just did absolutely nothing for me. It's really quite lame. Where are you, war? What war? War! Oh, what oh, war! Calm down, war! Calm down, war! There we go, war! Silly war thought he could do things, and then silly fallen thinks he could do things. Okay, cool. Oh snap! Uh, Ludo, we get a controllable freaking godhead or a sorry monstro's lung. You are fun for a while, but I'm afraid, uh, I'm afraid you've just got to give it up. You got to give it up. You got to give it up for the Ludo. This run right here. Ah, it's exciting. Is it not? It is exciting. And at any moment, we are going to... <laughs> Oh, and the thing is, the thing is, it's got homing already, so I don't even really need to aim it properly to completely annihilate everything. It's just like automatic destruction, and that is quite something. That is really, really quite something. Though I guess it's technically, again, not as good as it originally seems, because of course you have to deliberately hold the aura over people instead of holding the shot itself. So in that respect, it's not as good. But at the same time, it's also fantastic. So, yeah. Poor things. Poor things. Look at them. They tried so hard. Jesus Juice will raise our damage once more, and I guess we'll take you, Ghost Baby. Just because you're the final one that we get. And, you know, it wouldn't feel right to leave you all behind. Now, granted, it does make our Mongo Baby a lot worse, but, you know, I just, I felt bad for him. I felt bad for him. I really, really did. It was, you know, I don't like leaving people behind. I think that's a, you know, it's a bad thing to do. It really is. What are you, the Hanged Man? Absolutely no use for you. So I guess we will... Keep our old one. What do you have? Again, nothing crazy. Telepills. Where are we going? That might be perfect. Yep, that is literally perfect. Why is everything that can go right going right for me so easily? I don't really understand it. Also, that was ridiculous. And for those of you that keep asking me why I always ignore the devil slash angel room on It Lives, it's not a real one, it just takes you to the next floor. It just seemed to be a bit of confusion about that each time. Sorry, beggar, I actually don't have money for you for once. I'm not just being lazy. I genuinely have nothing to give, and I know that's a shame. I do, I, I know that's a massive crying shame, but... Ha ha! Don't actually do that in real life, though. And also, where the hell is my guppy? It should be here now. It really... I just realized something. I went cathedral by default. Instead of going to the shoal. Because I'm a moron. And forgot what I took. Because I'm used to just constantly going to the... The chest. I, I completely and utterly forgot what the actual plan was um, for this run. I am a utter, utter fool. An absolute utter fool. And I, I, you know, I feel bad. I really, really feel bad. Okay, so you know I could not leave you hanging after a promise like that, but what's very weird now as we descend to the shoal is that the run played out differently. As far as I'm aware, I did everything identically, except this time instead of Ludo, we ended up with uh, some... Uh, Polyphemus, and then Mum's knife, so I'm not really sure what causes that level of uh, variance, but I guess I should just accept it. Also, I didn't find the map this time, so I just, 
I don't know, but there's also a part of me that is, of course, exceedingly happy that we are rocking Polyphemus with the Godhead. I, I, you know, I don't think, I think out of all the items to have replaced, that's a pretty good one. It's only a shame we didn't still get Ludo Technique afterwards, it really, really is. And with all these at chess, we are totally, surely, statistically, going to guppy fight at some point. I will do it! Come on! So close! Every single time, I'm so close. And it just doesn't work, and it's so sad, and I just don't know. I just don't know, you know? It just, it just, it's just difficult. It's just difficult. It's just really, really difficult. But goodbye, Satan. Watch me accidentally have picked up the Polaroid, and now we have the same issue. All right, dark room. Give me the guppy. Oh, actually, that just multiplies our red chest by a lot, so that's something, but not really enough that it makes any kind of sense. Speed down does nothing. Tears down, that's annoying. I can see forever, might be useful. Fortune energy, not as much. Telepills, that's really bad. And we'll never know what that last one was. We'll never, ever know. Damn you, Guppy. And yes, I know I'm still holding the left hand because I refuse to give in. If there's one thing I will do, it's become Guppy, this god damn run. Really thought that would just one shot everything. And as it turns out, Tammy's head with Polyphemus on top of uh, this. Come on. Ah. Ugh. Tammy's head with Polyphemus on top of Godhead is really quite nice. As far as everything is concerned, it's really quite acceptable. I am a little bit concerned that I am, of course, uh, on such low health, but, you know, I, I got this right. And I guess maybe, actually, I should uh, swap out of the left hand now, because I actually think random items will do more for us than getting guppy at this stage. Oh, wow, it's still red chess, really? I swear it was just normal chess past this point. Whoops, back to the drawing board as we have our new life. There we go. Oh, I was like, hang on a second. Why did Tammy's head not go off? And then I was like, because I'm an idiot. Seriously, it senses how much of an idiot the person using Tammy's head is, and then it decides whether it's actually allowed to go off. That would be some advanced mechanics, now that you think about it. Like, some really, really advanced way of uh, telling something. I do like I can just put death everywhere. It makes things like this so much less scary than they would otherwise be. So that is good. And Isaac's heart doesn't really do much for me, so I'm just going to not have Isaac's heart here, I think. Uh, Mr. Mega, again, doesn't do much for me, but I guess it's better than nothing. My worry here, as we double can see forever, is actually beating the lamb with what we... Oh, snap! That suddenly is very good. Getting 20-20 on top of this. That is excellent. If only it transferred to Tammy's head there, but I am very glad that we went for that. Okay, there we go. That is that is how it's done right there. That was just destruction. Hey, Capricorn! We get all our stats up, meaning we actually can take a hit against the lamb, meaning we're probably going to be A-OK. -okay. Is that not just the best? And we're actually clearing the entire dark room here, which I guess is actually pretty good, because that way we get to experience maximum Godheady. That was really terrible, and I deeply regret my decision. I uh, deeply, deeply regret my decision. But we didn't die, so it doesn't actually matter all that much. Give me more items, more items I need. In fact, let me know if one of you guys manages to copy this run. That's kind of useful. I think that gives me an extra hit. I mean, that certainly does, but we've gone this far. Let's clear this bitch. There we go. Bye, Mega Fatty. And it's time to slay ourselves a lamb. Let's do it. Let's do it right. Okay, actually, this is just kind of destruction. Yeah. 
don't really know what I expected there. My name's been Rage, I'm a like if you enjoyed this and subscribe for more. Oh, good boy. You